Hi everybody, Jeff Hemmelt from SFMSports.net here with head coach Graham Miller after the Mustangs lose a close one 2-1 against Catholic here at Mustang Stadium. And Graham, it's the cliche, it's a tale of two halves. That first half, you give up the two first half goals, down 2 nothing. Catholic had only conceded one goal all season coming into mm -hmm. this fourth game of the year. 2 nothing down, what was the sense of uh, your team talk at halftime? No, we just, you know, we obviously um, started a little slow, you know, and that's been part of our downfall over the last couple of years. So we got to find a way. That's what we're just talking about now is finding a way to start faster. Um, once we, you know, at halftime, we talked to them about, you know, we're still in this game. You know, we had two great chances, you know, Kelsey and Brianna, you know, they could have tied up the game at the half. So we've got to be more ruthless in front of goal, finish our chances. They finished their chances. We gave them you know, poorly individual defending. So I think um, we had a good talk at halftime and, and the girls were ready and you've seen a very good second half performance. I mean, you know, great goal from Callan and, uh, you know, crossbar and maybe a couple of penalty calls and uh, referees coming over, so I won't say too much. Um, but the uh, so we pushed them hard that second half. They're a good team, regionally ranked. And uh, if we just got to play for 90 minutes. I want to bring up, since you mentioned her, the two sports star, Kellen. Uh, she got her first goal of the 2016 campaign. How's that going to help her confidence going forward? Well, I think, you know, we, we start scoring goals. I think the floodgates will open. You know, if I think if we got that first one in the first half, it would have given the girls more confidence. Two freshmen, you know, missing chances. Kellen, you know, she's going to get going as well. You know, she once she starts, she did it last year. She did it the year before. So I was happy that she got her first goal, and she almost she almost got another one there. Yeah. One and three overall to start the season. I know you had a couple one-goal losses, including tonight. Um, you're in the middle of a six-game homestand, so home form, as we know, is very important. So how much has that been an emphasis to your girls uh, this early part of the season, the home, the home stand, and trying to pick up uh, results here in, in non-conference play before you hit the Commonwealth? Well, that's it. I mean, regardless, home and away, you know, these are tough teams we're playing. You know, Catholic's good, Frostburg's good, Salisbury's going to be good next week. So both of them are, you know, these are all tough games that prepares us for the conference games. So we're excited to, um, you know, get ready for Friday again and, and, and be at home. And, you know, we've got to take advantage of being at home and start faster since we don't have to ride in a bus. You know, the girls are comfortable. They can, you know, take the, take the day to get ready. So that's what we're, we're going to look to, you know, look to get ready for Friday. Graham, again, commiserations on the loss. Thanks again for joining us, and uh, we'll see you. I hope to bounce back on Friday. Thanks, Jeff. Graham Miller joining me after the Mustangs fall 2-1 here to Catholic and Mustang Stadium.